Hello and welcome to this tutorial in which you will learn how to use a program called Pixlr so that you can digitally color uh, coloring book pictures. So let's begin. Go to pixlr.com and choose Pixlr E and then you'll have an image that you've downloaded and what we'll do is you'll drag and drop it into the interface. See open file, boom, and just hit apply and your image will appear. Here's your backgrounds. You need to make layers. You click a plus, you make a new layer, an empty layer. And then what you do here is right click on the layer and the blend mode, you change it to multiply. It's very important you do this on every image above the background layer. And then you can name the layer, whatever you want to do it. You can call it peach for maybe the color and at this point, you now have a layer where you can color onto. Control plus, up close, control minus, backs you up. Okay. The two tools that we're going to need is the draw tool and the eraser tool. Nice and simple. So we come here, we click, and we can select our colors. You can roll here, hit OK. Now this color is selected and we bring our paintbrush tool and we make sure that this layer is selected. And we can also here change the size of our brushes, the softness, the hardness. And so now we have a larger brush. See, I'm painting it in and I'm going over the black, but once I let go, because this is set to multiply, the way that the pixels behave with each other through the layers changes. So what we're going to do is on this peach layer now, we're going to grab our eraser tool and we can erase what we don't need. So this allows us to be able to uh, clean up our, our images. So this is just to show you what's possible. This is Pixlr. Once you make all your, say we make another layer here, empty layer, right click, change it to multiply, come here, click, pick another color. We'll use this green. Okay. Now we're on layer three. I can grab my paintbrush tool, start painting with this. Once again, see, I can go over the lines, but because it's in multiply mode, I could then clean it up nice and simple. All right. Let's say if I was done with this picture, I want to then put it up and click on peach here so I can erase peach. Uh, looks beautiful. They call me Picasso. When we're done and we're ready to print, we click up here to file, save, uh, save it as a JPEG. You may want to change the name here to whatever you want. Best practices, don't use spaces, high resolution, and then you would hit download. And then what it'll do is it will download the file to your computer, which it has done for me here click on it then I double click on the picture and it shows me the new image that I've made with the colored which now I could submit and this is the tutorial on how to use Pixlr to to color um, coloring book like pictures using digital formatting and actually this is a great step to learning Photoshop hope you find this to be very very useful have a nice day